Hi guys, I hope you are all doing well. Let's see today's question. So today's question is from the topic of tangents and normals. And in this question, we have been asked to find the equation of tangents. And we have to find this equation of tangents for the curve, which is given to us. That says y equals to x square minus 1 into x minus 2. And we have to find this equation of tangents to this curve where this curve cuts x-axis, right? So basically we need to find all the equations of tangents would be, which would be present at the point where this expression or this equation of the curve cuts the x-axis, right? Let's try to find out this. So now, first thing we know that when I talk about any point on the x-axis, so any point on the x-axis, if I see, it would be having an x-coordinate and the y-coordinate in this case would become zero, right? So always the curve, whichever is present and it cuts the x-axis, will have its x-coordinate and y-coordinate become zero. So to find these points of intersection of this curve with x-axis, I can easily put y as zero in this expression. So if I put y as zero in this case, what do I get here? I get here as x square minus one into x minus two is equal to zero. So here I get this points x minus one into x plus one. So I can expand a square minus b square as a plus b into a minus b, x minus two is equal to zero. So from this expression, I actually get three points of x. First is x minus 1 is equal to 0. That gives me x is equal to 1. Next, x plus 1 is equal to 0. It gives me x equals to minus 1. Or it can be x minus 2 is equal to 0. So x is equal to 2. So I get three points of x where this curve intersects x-axis. That is at 1 comma 0. So if I draw this x-axis, y-axis, so one is one comma zero, other is two comma zero, and the third is minus one comma zero. Right? So these are the three points where your curve, which is given to us, this equation of the curve intersects x-axis. Now we need to find the equations of tangents at this point where the curve intersects x-axis. So we need to find all the three equations of the tangents. Now we know one thing that we know all the three points on the x-axis where this curve intersects, but we would also like to find the slope of the lines or slope of the tangents which would be present. So once I get the slope of the tangents as well as I know the coordinates of the point, I can just apply y minus y1 is equal to m x minus x1 to get the equations of the tangents for all of these three points, right? So let's do it one by one. First of all, let's try to find out the slopes of all the three points there. So if I want to find the slope, I know y is x square minus 1 into x minus 2. So if I differentiate this equation of y with respect to x, dy by dx becomes. So u into v idea if I use, it is u into derivative of v that is 1 plus x minus 2 into derivative of this that is 2x. So if I expand what I get x square minus 1 plus 2x square minus 4x. That gives me 3x square minus 4x minus 1. Right? Now if I want to find the slopes at all those three points, I can just put in those points there. So dy by dx at this point that was 1 comma 0. If I want to find it out, I can just put x is 1 here. 3 into 1 square minus 4 into 1 minus 1. That is 3 minus 4 minus 1. So 3 minus 1 is 2. 2 minus 4 is minus 2. Finding the slope at the another coordinate. That was 2 comma 0. 3 into 2 square minus 4 into 2 minus 1. That gives me 4 into 3, 12. 12 minus 8 minus 1. So that is 3. And the third slope, dy by dx at the coordinate minus 1, 0, that becomes 3 into 
minus 1 square minus 4 into minus 1 minus 1. So that gives me 3, 3 into 1 square, that is 3, minus 4 into minus 1, so plus 4 minus 1. So this becomes 6. So I get the slopes at all the three points now. Now I can just find the equation of those tangents. So let's do that. Finding equation of tangents now. So talking at the first coordinate, that is when the curve intersects x axis at one comma zero. Now, what is the slope known to us at that point? Slope at one comma zero, we have already found out that was minus two. And the coordinate is already known to us. We find the tangents equation. Second coordinate was two comma zero. That was also known to us. And the slope at that point came out to become three. And to find the third equation of tangent, I also know that coordinate minus one comma zero and the slope at that point came out to become six. Okay. So now I have all the three coordinates with me where my curve intersect x-axis and I also have the three slopes of those respective coordinates, right? I can now just find the equation of tangents by using the idea y minus y1 is equal to n x minus x1. So if I use that, I can write the first equation of tangent as y minus 0 is equal to minus 2 into x minus 1. That gives me y is equal to minus 2x plus 2. If I take it on same side, 2x plus y minus 2 is equal to y. So this is my first equation of the tangent where the given curve that was given to us that this curve intersects x-axis, right? So I have got the first equation of tangent. Let's find the second also. Second equation of tangent, same idea, y minus y1, that is 0, is equal to m x minus x1, so x minus 2 y is equal to 3x minus 6. So that gives you 3x minus y minus 6. This is your second equation of the tangent. And the third one, y minus 0 is equal to 6x x plus 1. That gives you y is equal to 3x plus 6. And that becomes 6x minus y plus 6. That gives you the third equation of the tangent. So we get all the three equations of tangents that are formed when this curve y equals to x square minus 1 into x minus 2 cuts the x-axis, right? And the three equations of the tangents we have are 2x plus y minus 2 is equal to 0, 3x minus y minus 6 is equal to 0, and 6x minus y plus 6 is equal to 0. I hope you have understood how to solve those type of questions. Wherever we need to find the slopes or the equations of the tangents. So the first thing what you do is whenever you want to find the equations of the tangents, first try to find the coordinates of the points where the given curve intersects, given x-axis or y-axis, whatever is given. So in this case, it was intersecting x-axis. So I just put y as zero and I got three points of intersection of those curve with the x-axis that were the three x coordinates. And once I got the three x coordinates, and basically I got the three coordinates with me, then I just found the differentiation of y with respect to x. And at various three coordinates which we got, we get the slopes of those tangents. Once you get the slopes of the tangents and once you have the coordinates with you, you can just find the equation of those tangents with this formula y minus y1 is equal to m x minus x1. I hope you have understood how to solve this type of questions. I'll meet you again tomorrow with the next question. Till then, you can like, share, and subscribe if you're finding these questions helpful. Thank you.